Hello, everyone, and welcome to episode 82 of Six Figure Live. Uh, today, I'm messing around with a uh, green screen, uh, not for Six Figure Live. I just figured I would do it. Um, I would have it in the background just to mess with you guys. The color balance between my skin looks like so weird. Steven, can you pull this thing out of here? It looks terrible. <laughs> so I'm messing around with the photo booth this weekend. Um, and uh, the photo booth event is going to be using a green screen. And so we've just been like dicking around with it today. And uh, thanks. You could look at you moving crew. Oh, man. Okay, cool. Oh, the color is back. You guys, what is going on? Michelle Harris, how are you, girl? You guys, this is episode 82 of Six Figure Live. My name is Ben Hartley with Stone Story Creative and Six Figure Photography. And if this is your first time joining, Welcome. Um, the entire purpose of Six Figure Live is to bring you guys behind the scenes. I had to let you guys know what's going on here at Stone Story Creative to get you inside of my head uh, just a little bit to find some inspiration, a little bit of motivation to keep things going. Um, that is that is really the goal here. And the other and the other really important part, Sky, Nay, hey guys, Amy, is because of this right here, the fact that I get to see comments come through. Look, I'm going to be heading over to Show It United uh, here next week. I leave on Sunday. I'm going to meet a, a ton of amazing photographers, a ton of amazing people. And and, um, and I don't want to wait. I don't want to wait till then, okay? Uh, so hop on here. Leave a comment. Say what's up. Let me know what's going on in your life. I'd love to connect and talk with you guys. Um, and on that note, too, if you're going to be at United, come say hi. Come talk to me. Like, I would love to chat. Um, I was going to be doing a uh, – I'm going to be doing a – I'll be speaking there doing a breakout session. And I'm going to, like, rock – Rocket, dude. Uh, I'm gonna try to get your name right, Shafali. Hopefully, I said that night. What's up, man? Um, so uh, I'm gonna be rocking a breakout session there. Uh, but then as well, I'd love to talk about albums. I'd lo- I'd love to talk to you guys about print products and all that kind of stuff. Uh, and so I'm not gonna be doing that during my presentation. So come find me and let's go get coffee or a cocktail or something and let's talk about that. Uh, because I'd love to sit down and uh, and let you guys know all my thoughts. Um. Look, uh, I've got a couple thoughts here today um, that I just want to dive in on. I'll keep it brief, um, mostly because I've got a lot to get done before I leave for United. But I was reading and um, and I read a quote that um, got me thinking. Got me thinking a lot, um, simply because of the conversations I've been having with you guys, the conversations I have with myself all the time. Um, and so let me pull this up for you guys. I just want to share this um, because... It really got me fired up for a minute Um, and thinking too. Um, This is a quote from Mark Twain. Uh, This quote says this, Mark Twain, most men die at 27. We just don't bury them till they're 70. Do you guys get that? Most men die when they're 27. We just don't bury them until we're 70. You guys, we have such a luxury. We have such an amazing opportunity as photographers, as solopreneurs, as entrepreneurs, as as business people to, to continue to play and create and challenge ourselves in a way. Um, I, I just, I think that so often I talk to people, what's up, Lacey? I talk to people and even myself where, you know, we get a year in, we get six months in, we get two years in, five years in, and we're like, man, is it worth it? this is hard. Like, is it worth it? And I think about the alternative. You guys, most men die at 27. Most men give up and they, and they become cogs in some wheel. And, and I, I just love the fact that we don't have to do that. We get to be artists. We get to like still be kids and play and it's challenging as hell, right? Like the grind can be challenging, but that challenge is also like what makes it so damn worth it. Isn't it? Like when you work your ass off and you get that client and you level up your game and you get get an album in someone's hand um, and you take that shot and you learn something and uh, and it moves things forward, that does so much for your life. It does so much for your heart. I look at my little girl, B. I've got a daughter. She's two years old. And um, whatever she does, man, I just, I, I want so badly for her to be someone who is reckless and fearless and just goes out and, and just, and conquers the world and fails along the way. You guys, this quote isn't about not failing. You get that, right? Like fail left and right. You're going to fail. Like I failed so often. I'm going to continue to fail. Um, but that's what makes us alive. You guys is moving through that and keep pushing through. I just want to encourage you guys. Like we're, we're getting to the end here of, of, of this really cool crazy busy season and we're kind of looking at next year and I think a lot of us are looking at next year with a little bit of fear in our hearts with a little bit of panic trying to figure out man is it worth it to try to find another 20 30 clients for next year or, or however many you're trying to get right is it worth it to attend the next bridal show should I, is it worth it for me to go to united or, or mystic or or whatever um 
uh, or maybe you're struggling with that client who's just been a, a, a nuisance to you and they've complained about X, Y, Z and you're questioning your worth and you're questioning whether or not you want to keep doing this. Can I please encourage you to keep doing it, to keep moving forward, right? Um, surround yourself with people that are going to keep building into you and keep lifting you up. And, and, and when you fail, man, just like, like take, take it on the cheek, spit out the blood, um, and say now what mother effer and like, keep going. Right. That's what I want for you guys. Um, it's really the try the way I try to, to live my life. And it's, it's a challenge, right? And again, I'm saying this to you guys cause I'm saying it to myself, right? I'm telling myself this. And so I'll be going back and watching this again. Um, Jill, Ben, Amy, probably a dumb question. Amy says this, how do we find out more about United? Amy United is in like a week. Um, so go to like show it, United. just Google show it United. Uh, it's in, it's in Arizona. Um, so go Google it. And, and if you can still make it, please come. I would love to see you there, girl. Um, so there you go. All right, you guys, um, please be encouraged. Please keep rocking it. Um, d- don't bury yourself. Like don't, don't cash in yet. Like keep moving forward. Um, we've got, we've got the ability to, to live such an amazing life doing what we do. Um, and so I'm excited for you guys. I'm excited for that. Um, I've got to get some things done. I keep saying that. Um, I've got to keep getting editing out. I just busted an engagement shoot. Kate and Tyler, it's coming to you guys if you're watching. Uh, and so I'm super excited about that. You guys, uh, we'll see you tomorrow. Tomorrow is Q&A Friday, right? Episode 83, Q&A Friday. I've got a crazy busy day, uh, but I'm going to make time for you guys. I don't know exactly when it's going to happen because I got to get this hair did. I got to get a haircut for my for my talk at United. Um, we've got an ultrasound that I'm super excited to see our little twins at. Uh, round two to see our twins. Um, I'm going to be running a photo booth event a little bit later, but ultimately I'm going to make time for you guys. So please get questions in for Q&A Friday. Uh, make sure you have them. Uh, and if you want to get notified for when I go live for Q&A Friday, um, I'm going to go ahead and, and link to this. I'm going to post a little thing that'll show you how to get notifications. So that way every time I go live, you can actually watch live and you can say fun things and we can interact. So um, thanks again, you guys. Thanks for showing up. Um, cheers. Uh, so much respect for you guys. All right. Bye everyone.